on January 16, 2014. Atmospheric scientist Dr. Judith Curry testified to the U.S. Senate that the recent IPCC AR5 report weakened the case for human-caused global warming. She also said that claims of extreme weather being a result of human impacts on climate were false. She said that the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change and the SREX, the Special Report on Managing the Risks of Extreme Events, said there's little evidence that extreme weather events were related to human impacts on climate. So why is the Prairie Climate Center claiming the opposite? Then they state there will be a lot more extremes, even though the leading climate authorities say this is not true. They say there will be more floods, even though the floods, like Calgary's 2013 disaster, was just one of the many floods in Calgary's time. In fact, eight of the worst floods in Calgary's history occurred before 1933, with two of them having larger flows than that of 2013. Downtown Calgary is built on a floodplain. What do you expect? And most of the southern prairies are part of what used to be Lake Agassiz, a huge glacial-era lake that left behind fertile soil and low-lying land. So, when it rains a lot, it floods. Prairie Climate Center also say there will be more wildfires. But wildfires are largely cyclical due to the aging and renewal cycle of tree growth. Due to better management of forests, Canadian wildfires that threaten communities are better managed. Wildfires occurring far from communities are left to burn because that's how the forest renews itself and resolves fire risk. The Canadian Interagency Forest Fire Centre reports continued decline of forest fire. The 29-year mean shows no increased trend of wildfires for the prairies. Prairie Climate Center then claims there will be more drought. And in truth, there will always be a risk of more drought on the Canadian prairies because a large part of it is in the Palliser Triangle, a desertified region first identified in 1860 by Captain John Palliser, long before anyone ever thought of the term climate change or human-caused global warming. Then the Prairie Climate Center says there will be more severe weather, even though the IPCC and SREX say that is not the case. Prairie Climate Center claim this book of revelations will become the new normal, when that's not what the experts say at all. And then the Prairie Climate Center say they'll take you from risk to resilience if you just put up wind farms and solar panels on your farm. Wind and solar are ineffective and unreliable in providing energy. They do nothing to stop climate change. Further deployment is termed to be total madness by Professor Michael J. Kelly of Cambridge. So Prairie Climate Center is not reporting what the experts say. What's up with that?